Dave here, and today I'll be giving you all a Washington DC American Girl Store Tour. I'm super excited to do this for you all, so let's get started. So at the front of the store, they have a large Kira sticker, and they also have some world traveler sets behind the door, which I'll be going into in a second. So they had all the World Traveler outfits as well as accessories and next to that display they had the whole collection of AG books. There were a ton here. And then they had a hiking display as well as Team USA and some dolls that were featured in the display. They had a huge mural, mural <laughs> and some American Girl merchandise next to the Bistro which was closed the way it went. Well, the day I went, and then a huge cure display, which was to be expected. Most of her stuff was caged in by glass, but they did have two of her forts, and number one was there. Then they had Courtney and all her collection, as well as her Pac-Man machine, which was unfortunately broken because of no batteries. And then there was Joss's display. She had her whole cheer collection out. I wish I had stayed longer here, because there was a lot of cool stuff, but I kind of rushed past that to check out the historical characters. And here is Nenea, as well as Julie and Mary Ellen, and more Courtney's. I ended up getting Nenea. She will be opened later in this video. But there is Kit next to Rebecca Rubin. Adorable! And then there is Samantha, Kirsten, Addie and all the other dolls. I think they were missing Addie, but I didn't really check. Then another display with Melody, Nenea, and Julie. There was a ton of dolls in this store today. It was kind of crazy as well as the checkout counter. And here was her egg chair. So I finally decided to get Nenea. She is so cute. I'll be featuring her in more videos, but yeah, she is just adorable. So then I went over and put her next to the other Nenea just to compare them, and then it was time to go downstairs to the basement. And then they had Biddy Babies and Welly Wishers. The t twins were already paired, so you couldn't pair them yourself, which was pretty sad. But then they had more Welly Wishers as well as a few of their sets and cute things right here. Over to the other side, they had some other sets like the garden carriage and this cool little tree thing. I didn't really look at this, but they also had the mud play set house thing and their tent. Then there was the hair salon. I didn't buy anything here. It was pretty empty, the hair salon, although they did have a ton of products. And then they had the birthday collection, mix and match, and a ton of dolls, as well as a lot of girl clothes and doll clothes that you can match in, which I saw on the website, but I've never really found any interest in. And then they had some school sets, perfect because it's almost back to school, and doll and you matching backpacks. Then they had this shoe tree tower, I forget the name, but they had a few dolls there. And next to that, they had mix and match and more dolls. They also had the gaming console on the wall over there, as well as this three-in-one pool table. And it was just so cute. It looked really realistic. And then they had a few other sets next to that, like the kitchen set, spaghetti dinner set, and the spa set. And also this cool deal, if you bought an 18 inch doll, you could get their second book. It was called like Get the Full Story. But I didn't end up doing that, but it does look pretty cool. So you go there, definitely check that out. And then some special extras at the cash register. And then they had the Shine Bright Tea, oh, Oh yeah, it's a star right tea. Sorry for that little mistake. And then they had the a suitcase with the travel seat on it. I don't really know why they had that in there. It was just pre for advertising, I guess. And more dolls. And then there was Truly Me displays, kind of like, dis but really cool displays. It was sad that they were locked in because that would be really cool to play with. 
as well as a Dancing Through the Decades thing just advertising Courtney and Mary Ellen. And the airplane, it was open, but it was missing a lot of pieces. And then they, next to it, they just had this room set and a little arcade for Courtney, although I didn't see her in it. And finally, the last display in the shop was this gymnast one. It was adorable. It was for Team USA. So that's it, the American Girl Store. Thank you all so much for watching as I give you a slight little tour. And I'll see you all soon. Bye! Hi everyone, it's Molly here. And thanks for watching. Come back soon to see our next video. Bye!